fun fact, I recorded my reaction to episode 2 and 4 of Azoka, but turns out my mic did not pick up anything for some reason, and my soul was hurt. But honestly, luckily for the best, cause I did not have a whole lot to say. I'll start with the things I like, however. I like the cast, Rosario is slowly becoming the character to me. I like the costumes, besides Azoka's costume. I like how good the ships look, for the most part. What I'm not a fan of is the slow pace. It does not feel like everything is building up to something, just that they are taking too long just to get to that something. And though there are some cringe moments, I like the two leads in the story, but they are simply not strong enough to carry this alone so far. I like the uh, two, well, not the two, the old Dark Jedi, or whatever people want to call it. He's strong, he is shown to have honor, and feels like he has a story to tell. Student, her appearance has yet to give me reason to care much about her. However, I kind of have a big, a big problem I kind of have are the fights. To me, at least, the choreography is enjoyable at times, it's fine. But often, it is let down by cuts, camera angles, and overall cinematography. Well, not counting butt shots, because goodness gracious, I was literally going to have a butt shot per thumbnail episode when I was doing this. I might still incorporate the video somehow. Anyways, now the overall story is not gripping me. Maybe if I knew more, maybe if I watched the uh, Rebels, I'd be more invested, but. So far, no. The only thing that vests me is the fact that the map thing kind of reminds me of KOTOR. Still, while it's generally smart to never be too excited for anything, for any really fun ideas in Star Wars these days, I would say this series is fine. I give it a 6 out of 10. And I see 8 out of 10 potential in the future. Well, that's my thoughts so far. How about yours? Please remember to like, sub, and hit the bell. Later.